Rod Robertson passed away 4th February 2023. Following a diagnosis in one year with the knowledge of an incurable disease, Rod would fly off this earth for the first time without metal wings. On the 19th of November, the third attempt for the Kalula Coast barbecue breakfast fly-in was very timely. You can relive those memories in my last video. It would be Rod's last fly-in. Even though he lived there, it meant he was able to soak up the atmosphere with many other fellow aviators, friends and family who came to his field to enjoy the morning together. I wanted to fly to the memorial service about 35 minutes south of Maryborough. But it was going to be another Queensland thermal and windy summer day. I then thought I would drive after doing a quick errand at the airport. Dave was there, soon to depart in his CTSW, and he was obliging to fly me down with him. Thanks, Dave. The memorial service was actually a good time together, remembering Rod, a courageous, adventurous and colourful individual who loved challenging life and now at peace after a difficult 12 months. Thank you Rod for sharing your life with us all. It had been organised with purpose for two pilots and the Maryborough Aero Club Cessna aircraft to be at the field that morning. As a club member himself, as a club member himself, Rod had flown this aircraft many times in the past. The time came to push Rod out of Delta Mike Papa for the first and last time. His ashes were spread over the meticulously maintained Kalula Cove airstrip to rest in peace across the coastal landscape. The flight home was turbulent as expected but the scenery was wonderful. I will leave you in peace to see some of my recent images of the area that was very familiar to Rod where he once used to soar in the heavens. Thank you for watching and remembering Rod Robertson. This palm was read in honour of Rod at the memorial service. High flight. Oh, I have slipped the surly bonds of earth and danced the skies on laughter-silvered wings. Sunward I've climbed and joined the tumbling mirth of sun-split clouds and done a hundred things you have not dreamed of, wheeled and soared and swung high in the sunlit silence. Hovering there, I've chased the shouting wind along and flung my eager craft through footless halls of air. Up, up the long delirious burning blue, I've topped the wind-swept heights with easy grace, where never lark or even eagle flew. And while with silent lifting mind I've trod the high untrespassed sanctity of space, put out my hand and touched the face of God. John McGee, RCAF.
13, 12, 19, 41. Rod will forever be remembered for sharing his love of flying, having a joke for every occasion, his love of bass guitar, being a great listener, and his love for his family. The family would like to thank all who came along to celebrate the life of Rod. Your efforts, presence, and love is much appreciated. Blue skies and tailwinds, until we meet again.